Uh, you must have loved the quad series and would have got a lot of confidence. Uh, you guys, did you finish runners up in the quad series? Yeah, it was, um, it was a great series. Obviously, you know, it was, good. It was uh, England's best ever quad series finish. So, you know, yeah, we can take a lot of confidence in that moving forward. And, you know, hopefully we are on the upward spiral moving towards the world games. What about that? Some English supporters? Yeah, it's nice. We only had one cheer. Fantastic. <laughs> The sound of one hand clapping here at the Janaea Netball Centre this afternoon. An exciting year. Commonwealth Games Baton Relay coming through here very soon and you must be looking forward to that on the Gold Coast this year. Uh, yeah, it's really exciting. I think, um, you know, to be able to go to a major event that's bigger than your own sport is always a very special thing. So, um, you know, we're very much looking forward to it and uh, it's going to be an exciting event. Yeah, we're up for it. Congratulations on being MVP last year. Well done on the quad series this year. Perfect start for you guys. And let's go back to Rebecca to take the microphone to our next uh, Giants netball player, the great Kimberly Green, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Kimberly, uh, we've seen lots of posts on social media. You've got millions of followers. And where are you at in 2018? Uh, yeah, I'm back on court now, which is um, pretty exciting, I think, for everyone involved in my rehab. I was probably becoming a little child and a bit whingy on the sidelines. So, um, yeah, out there now, playing around, but, um, yeah, starting to do some contact work over the last week. I've been doing that and hopefully get out and play a game in maybe two to three weeks. Well, that deserves a round of applause. The great Kimberly Green back in action. Uh, Kimberly, almost the perfect year last year. What have you spoken about as a group about 2018? Uh, I think we had to acknowledge the fact that, um, you know, we didn't end up the way we wanted to, so we've acknowledged that, but now it's time to move on, and um, we do have a new player in Kira Austin coming into the group, so I think that's really exciting for us, and, um, yeah, I think for us moving forward is just being about discipline and making sure that we're doing those little things right and um, I think so far we've been doing that very well. What do you do between now and that huge double header in late April against the Lightning? So a grand final replay to open the season? Yeah, there's quite a bit to uh, go through. I think we haven't done a whole lot of combination work yet and we're still trying to get all of our players back. Bless you, Joe. Um, but yeah, like the fact that we've got Pratt's back in the mix, Bobby's come back this week. Um, Joe back on court, so it's been nice to get you know a few of us out on court now, and um, yeah, I'm really looking forward to the next few weeks and building combinations. Before we pass the microphone to Christiana Marwa, can you just say something about these Giants members and all the orange around here today? It looks absolutely amazing. Yeah, thank you so much for coming out on your Sunday. I think um, we love hanging out with all of you, and the fact that I get to present, or I get presented by Madison with my dress is really special and something that we hold very dear and we know that um, all of you are the reason why we're here. So thank you so much for coming out and um, yeah, showing up for us because uh, that's exactly what we need for this season. Ladies and gentlemen, round of applause for Kimberly Green. So a couple of quick final questions here. Christiana Manawa, you won't be joining us in co-commentary in 2018. It's a huge loss for our match day team. I know. I think you have to do all the work because I was carrying you last year, so I think it's time for you to pick up the game. Yeah, absolutely. You had a sore back in 2017 from carrying me. I know, lucky. I had to fix it before preseason, so I'm all better now from last yeah. year. How are you feeling? Uh, you're a superstar player, but we didn't get to see you in action last year. You must be so excited about the year ahead. Yeah, I'm super excited. You know, just to get through the first half of preseason was a goal for me. So to get out on the court as preseason match on Friday with the girls was actually exciting. And getting presented my dress now with Isabella is actually really humbling. To Isabella's mum used to coach me in primary school actually, which is really it's really cool. So it's good to see her, seeing her when she was a baby. So now to see her presenting my dress is actually really cool. And uh, what are your memories of that team? Primary school team? Yeah. Oh, besides me being the star of the team. <laughs> No, it was really, I, I loved playing in primary school. I went to Lonia Public School. My coach is over there, so she coached me. Yeah, I know, it was fun. Yeah, part of my start of my journey. Uh, that's what it's all about, the love of the game. Uh, let's pass the microphone to Kira Austin, who's part of this squad in 2018. Kira, how are you feeling? I feel incredibly excited. You know, it's something you always dream about as a young girl, playing up and watching the netball. So to actually, you know, be in the team this year is great. And this is all so new to me, so it's lovely to see everyone out here as well. Is there someone in the, in the group that you've spent a lot of time with that's kind of mentoring you? Oh, I think, <laughs> yeah, Bobby, definitely. Um, 
Oh, you know, Pratt's and I, she's been a really great mentor for me growing up. Back a few years when she was still in the Swiss and I was starting to train with them, so yeah. Yeah, it's a, it's a huge transition from that junior to a senior group and you're playing alongside people that you've admired and loved for years and that really are your heroes. And, you know, that's not an easy transition. Yeah, not at all. I think last year as a training partner, I was so nervous coming into the first course session. I was like, oh my gosh, all these superstars. Um, but, you know, this year it's been great. Like, all these girls are so lovely and they couldn't have welcomed me um, any better. Well, congratulations, Kira Austin and ladies and gentlemen.